change in residue has become a big topic around the coffee shop and internet. More robust, tough stalks, more corn on corn, good reasons why we really need to think about how we use a combine to set the stage for success for next year's crop. There are two expensive consequences from not managing residue out of the combine. First is the carbon penalty that happens in the spring when microbes feast on the residue and tie up the available nitrogen. That puts a young crop under early stress and can limit yield potential. The second also impacts yield potential by delaying germination. Small pieces of residue are difficult for row cleaners to handle. That leaves too much residue in the seed trench. Residue here causes moisture wicking and seedling blights that hurt germination rates and plant counts. I've tried everything, from old stalk shredders to the lawnmower style corn heads, to stalk rolls that turn corn stalks to confetti. And despite the cost and horsepower and dollars, I never found one that solved the problem. So we made our own. I wanted something that cut stalks into a nice seven inch piece. That's the perfect length for row cleaners. They can move them out of the seed trench with ease. I wanted something that gave lots of action sites for the microbes to work to break down stalks. Mike can't work on the rind or the sides of the stalk, only on the ends. So I wanted a system that created lots of ends. This is what I was looking for. Look at the perforations in the stalk. There's a dramatic increase in the surface area with plenty of ends where the microbes can get to work. But it's not confetti. The links of this chain are connected. So row cleaners can do their job and move them out of the seed trench. Here is a unique solution, 360 chain roll. A simple replacement stalk roll system for John Deere 600 and 4090 series corn heads. And soon for the Case IH 4400 series heads. Watch as a special tooth and knife design grabs stalks, perforates the rind, then cuts the stalks. Every inch, the tooth perforates the stalk, which not only increases microbial action sites, it helps dry stalks more quickly. Precision engineering with tight tolerances create consistent chaining patterns. Hardened surfaces actually get sharper with more acres and provide wear life that is similar to the standard stalk rolls. You can see the difference almost immediately. Breakdown starts more quickly. Just weeks after the tillage pass, you can see the clean soil profile, an ideal planting environment. And that's what I was looking for. Compare this to the stalks from the standard stalk rolls, long stalks and no action sites, or compare to replacement rolls that are too aggressive and make confetti. What doesn't end up in the ditch contributes to excessive carbon penalty next spring. Here's a photo from this fall, just weeks after the combine rolled through. Chain roll on the left, standard stalk rolls on the right. Chain roll is the solution I've been looking for. It's the beginning of my nitrogen management program because I'm eliminating much of the carbon penalty I know will hit this spring. It sets the stage for the perfect planter pass. I love this solution. It's simple, it works, and it solves a big problem in our high yield cornfields. Take a good look at the 360 chain roll and include this new tool in your nitrogen strategy for next season.